The immortal pen of James Fenimore Cooper brings you thrilling tales of excitement. Blazing action on the early American frontier. Stirring adventures filled with the daring and courage of Hawkeye, first of the long rifles, and his blood brother, Chingachgook, last of the Mohicans. Chief in canoe is Tuscarora. Well, looks like he's hurt. Look, brave is Tuscarora too. Shoot it, Chief! Chingachgook, Hokai, me, Tawanduma, chief of Tuscarora. You have trouble with your braves. Tawanduma, make long journey. When I get back to my people, I find, I find. We better get him out of here before that Tuscarora comes back with some of his friends. Is he? Chief, not bad hurt. Good. You find Tuscarora sign? Yeah, some new and some old. But I found something else kind of interesting. Come on. Well, he'll be all right for a minute. Smoke from green wood. Indian not build fire like that. That's white men, all right. And they're not very good woodsmen, giving away their position like that. Pale face not wise. With Tuscarora warriors in forest, if they see smoke, th that's what I was thinking. You think Tau and Duma will sleep for a while? Chiefs sleep like papoose. Settlers, not half scout, not wise, rifles not ready. If Tuscarora strike, like pigeon in claw of eagle. They've got to learn to take care of themselves. We teach? Yeah, we'd be doing them a favor. Hey, Marty. Throw a little more wood on the fire, will you? Aye, Captain. See, that wet stuff will burn if the fire's hot enough. Not as snug as shipboard, but when a man gets to be a landlubber, he's got to give up a lot of things. Say, Kevin. When are you going to let us pick out our homestead? Oh, there's plenty of time for that. Maybe tomorrow morning. It's nice to have a home at last. Ah! Indian! Ah! Man the guns! Watch the boarding parties, Marty! Take the horses! Don't stand there, man. Get a rifle. Who are you? What do you want? What do you got? 
Nothing, man, nothing. The Indians have it all. You don't move. Just like I thought, you Indians can't even keep your bargain. Now talk. Who's the leader of this group? Me. Captain Horatio Watkins. Former master of the finest square rigger that ever sailed the Atlantic. Well, I want to talk to you. Go to camp. Now, Mr. Whatever your name is, perhaps you'll be good enough to tell me what all this is about. Glad to. You're sitting here in the wilderness, completely unprepared. We just proved to you that two men could take over your whole camp. What chance do you think you'd have with a Tuscarora war party? What business is that of yours, mister? We're not afraid of any Indians. Well, maybe you ought to be. What for? We're under the protection of Tawanduma himself, chief of the Tuscaroras. Now, who are you? I'm Hawkeye. This is Chingachgook. Tell me more about this deal you've got with Chief Tawanduma. Hi, Mr. Hawkeye. I'd be glad to tell you. And in a few words, too. We bought and paid for this whole valley. It cost us practically everything we had, but we figured it was worth it. All this without spilling a single drop of blood. A home and peace with the Indians. We're friends with them. When did you last see uh, Chief Tawanduma? Oh, it must have been five or six days ago now. We're expecting him and the Tuscaroras to come calling on us and smoke a peace pipe any day. Tuscarora arrow, war feathers. Our feathers? Other feather mean they want powwow. What does he mean, powwow? It means they want to talk to you. But they're our friends. Why an arrow with war feathers? I certainly don't understand this. Let's talk to him. will meet with us. Now remember, no matter what they say or do, stay peaceful. Bye. Welcome aboard. What news do you bring from my good friend Tawanduma? Tawanduma, false chief. Why? What's happened? Where is Tawanduma? What does Long Rifle do here? Inani, you wear the feathers of a chief. Inani is chief of Tuscarora tribe. You, on Tuscarora hunting grounds, when sun sleeps for night, you be gone. We bought this land fair and square from Tawanduma. I've got the papers, and we're going to stay. Pale face lie. We bought and paid for this land. What'll I do? You heard him, Kanani. I always thought Tuscaroras were men of their word. Tuscarora make no treaty with Pelvis. Get nothing. How can that be? I paid Tawanduma myself. Tawanduma bad. Tribe get nothing. When moon rises, you be gone. Don't look like things is working out, Captain. It certainly doesn't. Not by a long sight. 
That fellow says he's chief of the tribe, and our agreement with Tau and Duma means nothing. What do you reckon's going on? Well, if Tau and Duma was honest about the deal he made with you, the only thing we can do is try to get him back in again as chief of the Tuscaroras. With Kenani figuring on attacking before nightfall, that's, uh, that's kind of a big chore to swallow, isn't it, Mr. Hawkeye? Kind of. Well, what are you all staring at me that way for? You heard what the fella said. Sure we did, Captain, and that's just it. What are we supposed to do now? I don't know what you're all getting the wind up about. You all heard the fella say he was going to get Tau and Duma back in as chief. And we heard that engine's warning, too. I say if we know what's good for us, we'll get out of here. Get out fast while we still got our scalps. Now, hold on a minute there. When you all signed aboard with me, it was agreed that I was to be captain of this here settler ship. And you agreed that every man jack of us had the right to talk up when it came to deciding what course we was going to sail. So I did. But we didn't come to this valley just to turn around and leave it the moment we dropped anchor. No, we didn't. We came here because we thought we'd bought peace with the engines. But we got no peace. The engines took our money and now they want our scalps. There's other valleys. I say leave. Maybe what Marty is asking us to do is right. Maybe we should get out. But we came out here to find a home for ourselves and our children. A port where we could feel we were free men. This valley's the home we found. The home we bought and paid for. And I don't cotton to being scared out of it by any pack of Indians. Then you figure we should stay? Take a chance on this Hawkeye fella to get us out of this fix? Well, the way I see it, a home ain't worth much that ain't worth fighting for. And I got an idea Hawkeye's going to find Tau and Duma. Change, Cook. Tuscarora Arrow. Feathers mean war arrow. Look. Tracks of two different braves. Tawanduma stood there. Chief tracks stopped there. Brave tracks get deeper mean they carry. But why they take him? Doesn't make any sense. If they wanted to kill him, they would have done it here. They're not headed for the Tuscarora camp. They try go fast. There's three sets of moccasin prints now. Tau and Duma's on his feet. Make harder to catch. Tau and Duma, good. Look now, great Tau and Duma. Mighty chief of Tuscarora. Hmm. Can I speak truth? Tau and Duma is chief. No true chief of Tuscarora sell valley to Pelves. Tau and Duma not do so alone. Wise men of tribe agree. Ah, old fools. Kinani no want Pelves here. Kinani only want to be chief. That is why he lied to tribe about me. Why he tried to kill me before I can tell Council of Treaty and make payment to tribe. Where Tau and Duma hide money? Tau and Duma tell only to Council, as chief. Tuscarora have no use for dead chief. You kill me. You will die. 
After you tell where you hide treasure Paleface gave you. Bring prisoner. It's only two or three hours till sunset. The settlers will be wiped out by the Tuscaroras. You follow Tawanduma. Leave a clear path that I can follow fast. I'll go back to the camp. I'll get the settlers to move out of the valley. When they're safe, I'll come back and we'll try to rescue Tawanduma. Ahoy there! Welcome aboard, Mr. Hawkeye. We've got the situation well in hand. You've got nothing but trouble, Captain. Oh, now I wouldn't say that. By the way you've got this camp set up, it would take the Tuscaroras about ten minutes to wipe you out. You've got about an hour and a half to break camp and get started out of this valley. If you want to save your scalps, you'll do as I tell you, and start now. We've taken a vote on this, Mr. Hawkeye. We've bought this land. It belongs to us. And we're not going to give it up. Take Tawanduma into Tibi. Kinani will get tried. Wipe out settlers. Then we'll make Tawanduma talk. Better go back a ways and keep an eye out for the Tuscaroras. Our troubles are over, then. Nope, we've still got a long ways to go, and the Tuscaroras are right behind us. But we've already plotted the course. All Tau and Duma has to do is to tell them the truth when they get here, and then take over as chief again. It's not that simple. Why not? Kanani has convinced the Tuscaroras that Tau and Duma is a cheat, not worthy to be chief. They won't take his word for anything. Hawkeye right. Blood of braves too hot, won't listen. They take scalp of all pale face and of Tau and Duma. Then we're just as badly off as we were before. Not if we can prove to the tribe what really happened. Kanani and war party, come. No time to prove anything now. We'll all lose our scouts for certain. Don't take any bets on that, Captain. We've still got a fighting chance. That was not move. Get warriors, circle camp. Can only give signal for attack. Settlers, fools. We take scalp, drive from valley, and Tuscarora be powerful tribe. I wouldn't be too sure about that if I were you. 
Don't make any false moves, Kanani. Hawkeye fool too. Tuscarora braves all around. Hawkeye's scalp soon hang from Kanani belt. I was thinking we might make a kind of a trade. Kanani, no trade. Well, I've got something I think you'd be interested in. What trade Hawkeye want make? Tawanduma will take you to the treasure. You can have it all for yourself. In return, we want a chance for Tawanduma to tell a Tuscarora his side of the story. We make trade. Good. But Kinani want trusted braves with him. All right, we'll do it your way, Kinani. Take away stone. Satisfied now? Kinani satisfied. Good. Then you can call off your warriors. Let Tawanduma tell about the deal he made with the settlers. Tawanduma, no talk. But you gave us your word, Kanani. A true Tuscarora chief never breaks his word. Only rabbit like Tawanduma keep word. Chief must be strong. That's why Tawanduma will die. Why, Kinani will be chief. Sure, because you lied to the tribe. If you let Tawanduma tell his story, they'd know what a great honorable chief he is, and that Kanani speaks with a forked tongue of a serpent. Tribe will never know. You're wrong about that, Kanani, because you've just told them everything I want them to know. All right, Chingachgook. I think it's about time that Kanani found out just what he walked into. See, Kanani, I had Chingachgook bring the tribe here to learn for themselves. Seemed the only way to bring out the truth. I figure you and your tribe know what to do with them without any help from us. of Tuscarora has met. We have come to tell you decision. Well, well, that's fine. I I'm very glad to hear it. But, uh, well, would you mind telling us what it is? Tuscarora tribe will honor agreement with Paleface. We all live in valley in peace. Chief, I don't know what to say. Except maybe thanks. Wouldn't care to ship aboard with us, would you, mateys? We could certainly use a couple of good hands like you. No, I reckon not, Captain. No. Cannot paddle canoe on dry land. Hawkeye and me want to find new rivers, new lakes. Only way to be happy. Reckon I understand what you mean, mateys. All I can say for everything you've done for us is, may you have happy sailing wherever you go. Join us again at this same time next week for another of James Fenimore Cooper's gripping tales of the early American frontier. Another exciting adventure of Hawkeye and his blood brother, Chingachgook, last of the Mohicans. <laughs>